Welcome to Easier Than It Looks, where you can learn yourself a thing real quick. So, right now, you want to learn inputs. Easy. Right here, I got myself a main scene. All we got is the root node, then the player. And for the player, all it is is the player sprite, a label, and then the root node. And we got a script attached. So, say you want to have a label pop up. This label, it's hidden right now. You want the label to pop up if you press any key, right? Well, what you do, you go in here, I'll teach you the first way first. You, you make an if statement, then you put in input dot, not L, is key pressed. Then this will give you a choice to make literally any key on your keyboard uh, an input. So for exa this example, we'll just go with key one. After you make the if statement, uh, what you want to happen goes right here afterwards. So in this example, it would be a label dot show. Yeah. Now, when we press key one, the label will show. So let's play it. One. And it looks like I did it right. There you go. Now say you want to use your own custom input, right? You can go over here, change it to is action press and then this will allow you to use uh, any other kind of inputs you would want uh, like controller support all that let me show you how to do that you go up here it's in project settings and it's this tab right here it's the input map now regularly the built-in actions are gone but you can click that and it'll show you all the actions you can use here but if you want to have your own you can just go over here to press uh, add new action and then let's just do show label. There we go. And we can get rid of this and we'll see it here. Then we can add any button we want. There's joypad buttons, there's joypad more buttons. Oh, these are axes, not buttons. Mouse buttons, like all of them. Then there's keyboard keys. For this one, let's just use escape. Sure. So then, instead, over here, it's a string and then you type in whichever one you want to do. So, show label. Now when you do this, you can understand it. Now, you have your own custom one. Boom. And using one, it won't do anything anymore. Now this, it will just repeatedly show, like it will repeatedly go on and on. If you keep it pressed. Like, uh, here. See, we are pressing it a lot. If you don't want that, you could uh, just go over here and just add just, just press. There we go. Now, it only press once. See, I'm holding it down right now. We're not getting it anymore. Now, say you want that label to show up if there's like an actual button on the screen that you press that is also super easy you just get the ui node button there you go you got yourself a button and, uh, there we go show show label i can't type today show label button bing bing boom this this bad boy's got so many options i'll go over these in a later video but what's important right now is if you go over to node you'll get all the signals but the one we want is press and then you can just link it straight to the player I'll go over signals in the future too and then here we could just move all this right here I said move all this right here there we go and now instead of uh, our input button like a uh, escape or key one or whatever instead it'll be a button on screen and that's just about everything you need to know about inputs let me know in the comments if you have any questions or anything you want to suggest for tutorials in the future i'm done here